welcome back to Skyward Ascent. This is episode four, and uh, yeah, we're back here at intersection one. Kind of set up a little uh, half base kind of thing. I haven't set my spawn yet. I should probably do that. But uh, yeah, transported like all the useful stuff from my forward forward base to this base. So I got like my chest full of junk and stuff. But uh, where should I go first? Let's see. Uh, so I came from there. So I like to go left first, right? I, I like going left. So murderous mushrooms. Mushroom areas are never difficult, right? And these creepers have been... So I was setting my base and a creeper just like walked right in front of me <laughs> out of nowhere, like fell from on top of the intersection. It turns out that these blocks weren't lit up up here, so he must have naturally spawned like on top of those blocks. So I went up there and put all those torches along the uh, ceiling there. And I don't trust these. I gotta put pressure plates on the ground. I don't like them. They're sketchy. I'm gonna trigger some TNT. Blow me up. Bleh. Oop. Hmm. You look a bit green about the gills, Shinto player. Not feeling sick, are we? No? Well, let's fix that. Great. I'm gonna get nausea. Fantastic. That's perfect for making videos. I have a bunch of nausea going on. Make everybody watching the video sick. But, uh... That should be fine, right? Hmm. Suffocating skelly. Does that mean he's got... A nausea bottle on top <laughs> for splashing on me. Yeah, pick up wood. I need, really need wood because I've just been too lazy to actually chop some wood. Ooh, don't see anyone up here. Okay. So where is this? Uh, are they just drowning? Who's there? Who's there? Oh, you in the mushroom. Oh, and he fell off. All right. Was this before some of these, uh, some of those pathing updates that made it so they don't drop down so easy. Mm, should I go for the building? I don't really need loot, so <laughs> might as well just kind of skip buildings, I guess. Yeah, I don't really have, really have to care about that. Oh boy, here comes the... Ow. 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 Okay, that's a lot. Um. Owie. Those are very painful mushrooms. I have to avoid them? Oh. That just means blocking and digging around. Ugh. Alright, well, let's uh, see if I can get around this thing. Okay. Spawner doesn't seem to go off too often, so I can kind of get myself around like that. Okay, let's not go for those arrows and bones on the ground, because it's sketchy. Golden apple, take that. Food. Food and wood's really what I'm worried about. Creeper's gonna get poisoned, right? So, go get poisoned. Go get poisoned. Ah. <laughs> Howie. Ah, was that slowness too? The well, not slowness too. I mean, like slowness as well. And what? How am I that close to? Oh, man! It's... Oh, it goes really far. <laughs> okay, I want to get away from this mushroom. There we go. Back to the loot chest. Eat. Regen up. Really had to put poison two on that. <laughs> Come on, you got just use poison one. It's not as detrimental to my HP. <laughs> Uh, should I just get rid of the spawner there? It's kind of close to the wall. Can't really get past it without having the chance to get hit. But oh boy. Yeah, this is not good. There we are. Alright. Got past it. Spawner's just up there. Scotty. Go away. Oh, how, what am I getting hit by? Is that really a super wide range spawner? Ugh. Making it all luck based or is there... There's no mushrooms up here. Well, there's little ones, but those don't give me potion effects, right? Do the potions reach all the way over here? Maybe I can get to that spawner from just reaching over. What? Skellies. Where you guys come from? Alright, alley. How am I getting hit? Really, it goes all the way into the building. Like, ah. Let's get rid of this spawner. Light it up. Oop. Die, die, die. Not me, though. Alright. Keep going around. Maybe there's more spawners. Apparently not. Um... Hey. <laughs> Uprooting all the mushrooms because I'm placing torches next to them. Oh, wait. Alright. Should be fine with this. I hear silverfish. Really hope the potion doesn't hit a silverfish because that would poison him, cause a uh, mayhem. Does poison too hit too fast for, for silverfish to use it to spawn more? Or is it like. Yeah, I don't even. Never tried putting poison too on a silverfish. I assume it would summon silverfish at the same rate. Just because that's just how it probably works. Oop. 
can't make him spawn faster than than they can already spawn, right? You can't make silverfish spawn. Oop. Yep, poison silverfish. Why? You've already used that. You can't use it again. <laughs> Is that a rule? Nah. Okay. Let's go ahead and loot some chest. Take some junk. Eh. I don't I bet that book doesn't work. Should I even bother picking up uh Enchanted books, like, I'm not sure if any of them are gonna work in this entire friggin' map just because the first few didn't work at all, so not sure if I should even bother taking the books. But maybe some of them will work later on. Okay. Ooh, hello, it's not a bad sword. I'll take it. And boots, I'll take those as well. Even though my boots are probably not gonna break for a while. Okay. This is another. No, this is the same area, so. Is this just a building that I've just fully explored? Or maybe it goes down on the other side somewhere new? Yeah, this is different. Alright, here's where the silverfish are. Okay, ow! Let's just get rid of this stupid spawner. Once and for all. Go away, you are very annoying. Alright. That should help a lot. Alright. Like, it was getting inside the building, too, so... I really had to get rid of that. Okay. Although it did do a lot of damage, I was getting rid of it. Press key. Can I one-hit these guys? Hmm. Okay. Let's just pop a hole in this, and then... Can the silverfish get through there? I think the silverfish can... Sil silverfish. I always say, like, silverfish. It's just, like, one word. Yeah, let's just pop that open. Get rid of you guys. And then... Yeah, it looks like nothing else is really getting through that one high... Uh, Gap, so just get in here. Mind up the silver spawner. Another one was revealed at least. <laughs> and hopefully there's no hidden silverfish spawners. Okay, more stuff. I don't really need raw potatoes. I already have a couple, so I don't need any more. Start chopping away at these guys. Da -da 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 -da. Hmm? Okay. Ooh, ironing it. It's my second one. Just need one more for my water bucket. Yeah. I, yeah, I love my water bucket. Uh, let's try to get through here. Rush in, light up. Hello, bricks. Does that mean wool? Already? Ah, oh, boy. It's fine. Blow up your friends. Um, that looks like a fleecy box up there, but that doesn't look like a very convenient way to get up. Okay. Although, the creeper spawn is down here, so I shouldn't have to worry about it creepers, right? Alright, staircase made. Shouldn't be too much of a hassle now. So long as there aren't too many mobs up there, just get them all aggro on me, get them all down here. Make this a uh, choke point. There we go. And no problem, no problem. I got diamond gear, what am I doing? These are just natural spawns, basically. No custom mobs yet. Oop. Ah, fairy. Although I don't have any feather, feather, feather falling, so it's not the best armor. Okay, it's not bad at all. Where did the skellies come from? Were they all natural spawns? Or are there spawners in the wall? I don't care. Let's grab this wool. Get out of here. Alright, which wool is this? Uh, damnation. Hell's blazes. Magenta wool is down. I felt sure that it was safe. Okay. Give me that. Sweet. So I did get it in the right wool order so far. Uh, except I got the wool. The, the white wool second, didn't I? Yeah, whatever. Got up to magenta now. Three wools down. Uh, Thirteen to go. Yeah. Okay, let's uh, try to just go down the river, because it's probably safer than going by the mushrooms <laughs> as I'm killing creeper right in my face. Yeah, go forward. Come on, push me forward, water. Aren't you flowing? Ah. Or it's the slowness doesn't affect you in water, right? Ow. Oh, is this the version that if you start like getting hit while underwater, you start getting hit down and down and down, and it affects like drowning too, so you'd always just start drowning and then you couldn't get to the surface. Uh, hope not. That was always just a yeah, scary. Just, ah, don't start drowning. If you start drowning, you'll never stop drowning. Hello, chunk error. Ooh, hello. That's... Can I see Felicia Box? <laughs> no, I love doing cheeky stuff like this. Um, I don't see any bricks. Hmm, or glass. That ah, must be like way back there. Ah, there it's, there's the wall. Lol. <laughs> okay. Um, let's put away stuff. 
It's from iron ingot. Iron ingot's there. Let's put this in order. There we are. Put away junk. So many bottles of enchanting. <laughs> like, if I need any level, I can probably just get it so easy with those. Good to know. Uh, put away some coal. Don't really want those boots. And don't really need these swords yet. Although, yeah, this is a good sword, right? Kind of want that on me instead of this one. There we go. And I'm all set for the next area, right? Uh, should be. Okay. Pickaxe is not doing so hot, but it's not that good of pickaxe anyway. Okay, next up, uh, Adrenaline Rush, I think. I like going forward second. Will you step with the pressure plates? <laughs> You're just sketching me out. This skelly over there, I don't want him to step on any. And, oh, the, the items even. <laughs> I don't want the items pressing him either. Okay. Die, Mr. Skelly. Swords don't mind it faster, do they? I don't even... I don't know. Alright. Well, um, let's get in here. See if I fall into the lava as fast as I can. Alright. Blaze. Where's your spawner, mister? Oop, hello. Ooh, custom mob gone. <laughs> How short-lived. Alright, where was that, Blaze? Oop, bop you off. Oh, dang it. Okay, is it in the tree? In the tree or under the tree? Let's find out. In the tree, okay. Right? You wouldn't, you wouldn't put a spawner in a glowstone tree, would you? It's just weird. Um, hmm. Yeah, let's just skip it for now. Don't really have to care. Just a blaze spawner. There's a custom mob. Now we see him for the first time, and he's gone. Ha. Huh. Wonder how much damage he does. <laughs> Into the lava he goes. Wait, die. Does he have regen? Hmm. Alright, it's just a... Uh, oh. Hello, aggro pigman. You don't seem very nice. Alright, let's get rid of that spawner. Okay. Just go along the side here, because screw that. <laughs> don't have a water bucket, can't turn that to obsidian yet. Not quite yet. Alright. Blocking it across, come on. Bah. There we go. Scully. Don't bop me out into the lava. Don't trust it. <laughs> Alright. There we go. And stuff. Now oh, come on, corner ladders. No spawners. Okay, chest stuff. Not really anything, <laughs> I guess. I'm gonna probably, could probably use a backup chest plate, because I don't have a diamond chest plate yet. Somehow, right? <laughs> he hasn't been giving out all the diamonds anymore. Where did all the diamonds go? Alright. Well, there's some nether ward, I guess. Um, something to note. And soul sand, so I can actually farm it. Alright, come on, guest spawner. Oop. No, you don't. Ah! That's awkward. Alright. Well, here I go anyway. Um, shouldn't get hit by anything except you. Okay. You are very fast. And I bet you have knockback. Just because you have an enchanted sword. Where's your spawner? You can't hide pigman spawners. Come on. It's not cool. Where's the pigman spawner? I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't want it. Don't, don't hide pig man spawners. They're not light sensitive. Let's just see if any of them spawn. I got time, probably. Oop. So right there. Um, right around here. But where? There we are. Okay. <laughs> Ugh. Hidden pig man spawners is mean. But, uh, yeah, iron chest plate. Eh. Stuff. Fire protection. Yeah, it's tempting. Alright. For this area, at least. What's on the leather? Yeah, junk. There's a chest up there I might want to go for, but meh. Let's just hit up. Oop, anything up here going to be spawning on me? Nothing. Okay, let's go around the lava. Might want to get rid of that guest spawner. Usually a good idea <laughs> to uh, get rid of guest spawners. Pickaxe about to break. Let's go ahead and replace it. There we are. Junky stone pickaxe. No enchantments. Blah. Where's my enchanting table so I can get some enchants on these things? <laughs> Not that generous, are you? Mm, maybe, though. Alright, uh, that looks promising. The uh, last area is pretty short, so maybe this is already next wool. Mm. I mean, this does look like a wallable building. Okay, um, how's this supposed to work? 
Um, I could just do that and then that, perhaps. I really should bring ladders with me, shouldn't I? I'm so lazy though. Okay, let's do that and then like that. And that's fine. Okay. Then I'm up here. Then I can. Ah. <laughs> Gonna be a bit complicated. Okay, there's a zombie in a chest over there. Oop. Watching your progress to the yellow wall sure has got my adrenaline pumping. Hopefully you won't notice the path leading to the second intersection. Ah, why do you say that? <laughs> Alright, sweet. Uh, oh, well, hello. Let's go ahead and get rid of the spawners first. So yeah, here's the path to the next intersection somewhere along here, I guess. Um, so I have to go back to that one last area, interse interse intersection one, to get that. And then, should I unlock the railway while I'm here? I mean, I, I assume it's somewhere in intersection two. Um, why would you have a unified rail network if you don't unify it? Okay. Well, yellow wall, sweet. Um, let's see, is there any path like up that I can go to that would lead the next intersection, or is it just behind this building? Uh, I assume it's just behind the building, okay. Oop. Falling, falling, falling. Ah, don't know why I did that. All right, um, where to? Yeah, it should be just, oop, there it is. Ah, silly me. Ooh. That looks like an important route. Enchanted book cache, medium. Let's see if they actually work. Hoop, hoop. Alright, burn. Not sure if I can like tell if they work or not by just standing here, but knock back. I'll just take the ones that look good and if they work, that's good. Uh flame to me. Alright. Sweet. Let's uh get to the second intersection and uh see what's there and see if there's a railway I can unlock. Perhaps. But I just made the base at intersection one. Okay. Ooh boat. Ooh. To be fair, that first intersection was easy. My grandma could have blitzed those areas. Owie, owie, owie. <laughs> I'm sure that you won't get past the second intersection, general player. Okay, um, he's very confident in his difficulty, but I, 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 I doubt. <laughs> intersection 2. Adrenaline rush. Blah, blah, blah. Right. Where's this rail? Where, is the, where are these rails? Gimme, gimme. That looks promising. This also looks promising because it leads down. And the railway inter intersection 1 was super down. So... Lily pads. Oop, oh, I didn't think I could make that jump. Corrosion fun kit. Uh, okay, that does look fun. <laughs> Sticky pistons for no reason. Okay. Can I make this back? Oh, nah. Lily pads, tricky. Okay. Uh, yeah, this looks promising. Gravel is catching me out, though. There's a trap in the last intersection. Uh, ooh, is this the... Ooh, is this the monument? Wow. Somewhat underwhelming. <laughs> Wilbur the Week. Um, my oh my, you're the first in 30 years to reach the World Monument. Listen closely. If you complete it, you shall rid this realm of crows forever. You must try your hardest, gentle player. I have money riding on this. Oh, you bet on me. Wilbur, you little puke. Vintage beef level 3. Still sharpness 3, so it doesn't do any extra damage. It's just fire aspect 2 and looting 2. Meh. Alright. Um, so yeah, World, world Monument. Sweet. So I still got the light blue wool left in intersection one, and this intersection should have the next three wools or so, so... Okay, there's only a block of iron, diamond, and ooh, there is emerald. Okay, so I gotta keep an eye out for emeralds. Why is a block of gold before the block of iron? That is backwards, right? Usually? I don't... Yeah, people. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, I gotta ha have my eye, eye out for emeralds, wherever they may be. High-speed rail line kit, so yeah, I'm gonna have to go ahead and plop a minecart down. And see where this goes. Oh, no, eh. Right clicking, e exit, enter. There we go. <laughs> so that's why they changed it to to a shift to get out of those uh, mine carts. And surely none of these are going to be a trap, right? You wouldn't trap the unified rail system. That's like the crux of the map, right? <laughs> you don't you don't trap the crux. That's just that's just mean. All right. Oop. Dig here to, to reach intersection one and link to spawn. Okay. If you have not reached intersection two, do not use this rail link. Blah blah blah. Okay. Another one of these. Hello. Not bad. All right. So I guess I'm gonna have to take time off video to. Uh, eh, I don't know. Probably not gonna move because I'm lazy. But yeah, got to intersection two. And uh, yeah, I'll probably just stop the episode here and come back next time for. Episode 5 already, geez. 
And uh, Skyway Descent, so thanks for watching. And uh, see you next time.